let's talk about Parkinson's, cognitive decline, and what we can do to reverse it. When I saw my neurophysio for an assessment the other day, she asked me to walk towards her and counted how many steps, it was 15 steps. And then she said, go back, and then walk towards me again, but this time, name vegetables. I tried to be a little bit smart about it. And what I said was, as I was walking towards her, stuff like, you know, tender stem broccoli, pak choy, chard, swede, that kind of stuff. When I finally got to her, she said, did you notice that you took four extra steps? I said, no. I said, well, you did. And here's the reason why. And I'm going to show you what you've got to do to improve it. Essentially, in Parkinson's, our ability to do something physical and like verbal, something cognitive at the same time, uh, is degraded and it slowly degrades over time and she said to me you probably find yourself when you're walking with someone and talking to them you start to fall back and it's true i do and here's what she said you've got to do to get out of it or to reverse it or fight back she said when you're hitting your boxing bag which is something i love to do she said count back from a hundred like in threes or when you're doing something like walking along you know um, count the alphabet backwards, you know, maybe in steps of two letters, stuff like that, things that stretch your brain while you're walking. And she said, if you do that, you will help to reroute the neural pathways and you will gain ground back. I hope that helps.